In this video, we will examine the gate cycle and demonstrate each component individually. One gate cycle begins with heel contact of either foot and ends with heel contact of that same foot. Therefore, one complete gait cycle consists of two steps, one of the right foot and one of the left foot. One gait cycle is divided into two phases, stance phase and swing phase. Stance phase is further subdivided into four individual parts as we will see in a moment. Right stance phase begins with heel contact of the right foot and ends with toe off of that same foot. Right swing phase begins with toe off of the right foot and ends with heel contact of that same foot. Stance phase makes up about 60% of one gait cycle and swing phase makes up about 40% of one gait cycle. Stance phase is subdivided into four components, heel contact, mid stance, active propulsion. Passive propulsion, the end of each phase marks the beginning of the next. Right heel contact begins with heel contact of the right foot and ends with toe off of the left foot. Right mid stance begins with toe off of the left foot. and ends with heel lift of the right foot. Right active propulsion begins with heel lift of the right foot and ends with heel contact of the left foot. Right passive propulsion begins with heel contact of the left foot and ends with toe off of the right foot. Again, stance phase is divided into heel contact, mid stance, active propulsion, and passive propulsion. The second part of the gait cycle, swing phase, begins where a passive propulsion ended with toe off of the right foot. and ends with heel contact of that same foot, which completes one gait cycle and begins the next.